This is going to be a tutorial about iMovie 11, about the animatics feature in iMovie 11. So the animatics feature in iMovie 11 allows you to create a storyboard, which it gives you, it gives you an idea of how your movie is going to look like before you even create it. So what you need to do is go to File, New Project, name it, I'm going to name it Animatics for now, Create, and then you have to go to the Media Browser buttons and click the Animatics Browser button, this one. And you're going to see all of these pictures here. And you have to scroll down to the bottom and you're going to see these gray and white pictures. These are the pictures that you can use for storyboard creation. Now, if, say, I want to create the beginning of my video using a landscape picture, then I'm just going to take the landscape picture from the storyboard pictures and drop it into my project. And here I'm going to have this little four second clip. And this was a landscape. If I want to follow up with, an, with, with a clip of an animal, then I can just drag and drop this animal picture. And then maybe, let's say, a close up of a man also. Now, after you have done these and you have your clips ready that you want to use for video creation, you're going to have to select the clip that you want and drag it and drop it onto the appropriate storyboard picture. Once you do that, you're going to have these little options here. These are the advanced tools. Now, if you want to use the advanced tools, you have to go to iMovie, select settings, and you're going to have to tick the advanced tools. So this little box needs to be ticked in order for you to use these. So like I said, drag it and drop it onto the appropriate picture and then you're going to have, these are pretty simple. The top three, these are replace, replace from beginning and replace from end. If you choose replace, it's going to put the whole clip that you just put into. It's going to replace the story for picture with the whole clip that you use. If you choose replace from beginning then it's only going to give you the first four seconds of the video that you use and if you use replace from end then obviously that's going to give you the last four seconds of the video only as you can see here and that's pretty much how animatics in iMovie 11 works so there you have it